Welcome back. So it's a one-woman show starring a fast-talking, gum-chewing Alabama gal who's bringing your grandma's Tupperware party into the 21st century. Please welcome Dixie, the hilarious star of Dixie's Tupperware Party. So I've been so excited Hi, to meet you and to have you so here in sweet. studio today. I appreciate that. You're so, I was commenting on your boots because they're so pretty. I love my cane standing. Oh my gosh, <laughs> thank you. Well, her footwear, you may not be able to see it, but I mean, they are amazing. Better. Just a As is the dress. You're so, oh, I love my little dress. I mm -hmm. got fabric. In, I was in Branson, Missouri, and I got this fabric, and I was like, oh, Branson. I, I was. It's in Branson, yes. and I said, it looks like a swamp. I'm gonna make a dress out of it. <laughs> so, it just reminds me of being, you know, sometimes when you got to get away mm -hmm. from the law, you got to find a place to hide. And I've hidden in the swamp plenty of time being Ooh. in Alabama. What okay, so what are you? Like? Yeah, what are you stepping in right there? You're I, hiding from the law. I, well, listen. I mean, I don't know <laughs> nobody that hadn't been brought up on charges for one or two little things. Not always that often, <laughs> but little things, you know. And then you become friends with the law. And they're like, hey, you know, and they come with the handcuffs and then you're like, bend over and it's a whole, it's like Ooh. a Friday night. But anyway, um, <laughs> no, but I like, and so I started doing Tupperware years ago uh, after I got out of prison one time and they're like, you need a job in order to get your kids back. I'm like, kids are sticky. Uh, but I said, <laughs> okay. And so I started selling Tupperware and it became this thing. Like I, I ended up becoming the top Tupperware lady in the entire United States, Canada. That is really I something. I swear to God, isn't that funny? Yeah, and that's a high five just, moment right I there. Yeah. You made me smile. <laughs> and uh, then I, a friend of mine said you should put this into a show so i did i created it as a show took it to new york ended up running off broadway oh, and yeah. then uh, that launched the tour and i started the tour in 2008 and mm -hmm. i've been going ever since so uh, it's 12 years now and then starlight um 12 it, years of tupperware parties that's going to be crazy sad, yeah. and then I, so i've been doing uh i've been do, uh, doing the show to, uh, did it in kansas city before mm -hmm. at starlight and then i brought my second show we never wore a tube top while riding a mechanical bowl and 16 other things i learned while i was drinking last thursday <laughs> A big title, I got yeah. a lot to say. And then, um, so, and then they said, We want to come back with this. And I said, I'd love to. And they said, Well, while you're here, it's going to mm -hmm. rain and thunder and sleet and snow. Welcome to Kansas City. Yeah, so welcome. I'm very welcome back. So, Kansas City, right? You've been here before. What are some of the favorite things or maybe some of the experiences you've had you know, already? It, it, every, first of all, everybody's so neighborly. I love yeah. it. It's like being, I feel Aww. like you got the Southern hospitality, but right here in the middle of the country. Midwest like, is actually, uh, so well, lovely. I mean, you're a Southern gal, so I won't say what I was going to say. Every but I love it here, and I love our everybody hospitality. Everybody's so, that's what I'm saying. Everybody's so nice. They're rubbing up on my leg like a dog licking up peanut butter. They're like, you <laughs> guys you know, and um, and like yesterday, I ran into the um, the the big bobbleheaded um, thing of the of the for the Chiefs because yes. y'all are kicking some butt this season. I'm very we proud are. of y'all. And so I got to uh, make Thanks. out with a little bobbleheaded thing. He's so sweet, and it's not supposed to make be out with the bobbleheaded. Well, I have a picture of me kissing him on the cheek, and yes. then he said something to my ear. It might have been him, but he was in, uh, not animated. So I was like, who's saying they want me by the dumpster? <laughs> anyway, but it was so sweet, and uh, but I love the, the the spirit of this town. Everybody's so neighborly, and everybody like people. Have come to the show have always been so kind and been saying the nicest things. So I love it. I love, and you have so much culture here and so much fun stuff to do here. And I mean, I, this is a city that I love. And there's, I, I love the shuttlecock. I mean, and I found the I shuttlecock Kansas City. You know that. Yeah. The, ugh. Who doesn't like an 18-foot shuttlecock? I want one in my backyard by my trailer. But they said, no, <laughs> it'll sink into the swamp. Um, but there's just fun, like really cool, unique, artistic things that are all over the city. And I think that's it's wonderful. It just keeps the, the city alive. Absolutely. And a lot of those happening right at Starlight. So. I've got a question. If yes. I don't have enough Tupperware, could I restock my Tupperware there? That is a sad story. <laughs> uh, you can, Sorry. like in the show. So the show is, it's like a Tupperware party on stage. There's games and prizes and raffles. I get people mm -hmm. up to help me. So it's very interactive. But then everybody gets a catalog in an order form. And if you want to, you can get Tupperware and take it. See? Take it with you. What a oh nice my gosh. thing you can have for your game keep day. Safe. You can yeah. have all your stuff. Hey, we're going to put my chicken wings in some <laughs> Tupperware so that people can put it in their mouth and be like, we need more ranch. And then We always need more wings and, and more ranch. Yeah. I mean, I Dixie. mean, that's going to go right on the tombstone. Need more ranch. Going to happen to get some. So. Well, Dixie, thank you so much. And we cannot wait to see Dixie's Tupperware Party. That's actually at Starlight Indoors through January 19th. For more information, call 816-363-7827 or go online to kcstarlight.com.